welcome to pharmaceutical concept today's topic of discussion is disintegration test dt in this we are going to discuss about principal disintegration time and disintegrants disintegration test complete disintegration does not necessarily imply complete dissolution much more research has been focused on dissolution rather than on disintegration testing Complete disintegration is defined as the state in which any residue of the unit except fragments of insoluble coating or capsule shell remaining on the screen of the test apparatus are adhering to the lower surface of the disc. If used in soft mass having no palliability film core, disintegration is a physical process related to mechanism breakdown of a tablet into smaller particular granules, representing the breakage of interparticular interaction during the tablet compaction of granulated particles of the active ingredients and excipients. Disintegration time is the time required for a dosage form to break into granules and specified size smaller under a carefully specified condition. In other words, DT is a measuring of breakdown of dosage form and dissolution is measuring during the solubilization in the media. Why is disintegration testing important? Like dissolution testing, disintegration is often a pharmacopoeial testing requirement for the vast majority of solid dosage form. It provides a critical safety data on drug viability in the body without having to utilize invariable methods. What is disintegrating agent? Super disintegrants are products of simple natural or synthetic pharmaceutical product but modified in such a manner so that their swelling nature is enhanced which helps in significant water uptake and helps in disintegration. A disintegration is excipient that is incorporated in the formulation of tablets or capsules to promote their disintegration when they come in contact with liquid or fluid matter. How we can improve the disintegration of tablet superintendents such as cross granular sodium CCS, cross providone, sodium trans glycol SSG are frequently used in tablet formulation and capsule formulation to improve the rate and extent of tablet or capsule disintegration and increase the rate of dissolution. This below tablet briefly mentioned about the details of the disintegration time limit given followed by the Indian pharmacopoeia. Below mentioned dissertation test is followed, these are the limits followed in British pharmacopoeia.
below table is the designation limit for followed by us pharmacopoeia usp